Well, good morning, Travis. We are back live on Amazon. And uh, as the uh, overlay says, this is uh, learn guitar and go camping. You know, uh, this last week it became spring. Yeah, it did. It did. <laughs> and a lot, in fact, a of lot spring. of people, yeah, a lot of people are on uh, on spring break this uh, around these weeks here. I know here in Oregon, uh, it's spring break and people are thinking about what they're going to do maybe with their family. And uh, one of the stories that you have told over the, over the years is how camping and playing guitar, especially learning how to play guitar with chord buddy, uh, just go together. Uh, absolutely. Uh, you know, and one of our best retailers uh, was a, was a sporting goods store who made a campfire scene sort of like you had on your uh, opening there. And uh, Oh Yeah. I mean, you know, I'm a camper, go camping, uh, and I always, always take my guitar. Uh, it's amazing. I, I'll be sitting outside just playing guitar, and people from other campsites will start migrating over to, over to me. You know, it never fails. Uh, yeah. The, the louder I play, the more people come. Yeah, you know, I love that. There's something, there's something about campfires and guitars yep <laughs> you know it was a uh, growing up there was always somebody that that could just pull their guitar out and uh you know it might be in the backyard around your fire pit or might be at the beach and uh yeah i when i was a kid i dreamt of being that guy <laughs> yeah. yeah and uh you know, I think there's a lot of people that said that they want to be that person, especially, you know, you, you enjoy singing and uh, being able to accompany yourself on guitar and uh, court buddy makes it really simple. Uh, and I've got highlighted in here. We've got the whole package that's got the guitar, the tuner, the learning system, everything you need to be able to play uh, songs right away. Absolutely. Yeah. I was just trying looking up some campfire songs here. Oh yeah. That, you know, that would be great if we can get, uh, we can get some, uh, a demonstration and show folks how chord buddy, cause if you buy the combination and, uh, I'll just remind everybody, we've got it highlighted here in the carousel. We're on Amazon live. If you go to amazon.com slash live, you can find us there. And, uh, uh, we've got a chat available. So if there is questions, or maybe there's some particular songs that you think, oh, I wonder if I can play that on Chord Buddy. Uh, you can ask Travis right here, and um, we'll get a demonstration. Uh, yeah, my family, I grew up camping. You know, we would always, you know, I've got, I've got in the, in the carousel, I've got a few of the things uh, like the old Coleman tent uh, or the little pop-up tents that uh we would take with us easy to set up perfect uh low cost great family vacations to go to the to the beach to the river to the mountains uh to the ocean and in fact uh travis there in in alabama uh you guys often head to um panama city i think is uh one well, of the destinations. Uh, we do go to Panama City a lot. We also go to Eufaula quite a bit. Uh, went over to uh, Frank Jackson State Park, the, our last trip. Uh, and uh, But yeah, I, I like to go to Panama City because there's a, there's a crab house down there I like to go to. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like you to know, often. Eat, eat crab mm -hmm. legs at, so. <laughs> oh that's great um well i see you so you got your guitar got the chord buddy on there and um what uh what uh camp song were you thinking of uh showing us today well i put in uh best campfire songs <clears throat> and the first one that came up is this one right here and it's got uh, played with chord buddy uh, okay, what? Let me let me just tune real quick. I had forgot that we were going to do this and hadn't tuned my guitar. And always, if you're out there, 
always make sure you're in tune before you start playing. Let's see. I'm trying to get where I can see the guitar a little better. There we go. Almost heaven, West Virginia, Blue Ridge Mountain, Shenandoah River. Life is old there, older than the trees, younger than the mountains, blowing like the breeze. Sing with me. Country road, take me home to the place. Mountain Mama, take me home. Country, Country roads. Road. <laughs> yeah, isn't hey, that great? You, you know, that and that's a campfire, Scott, and they will come running from the neighboring campsites, and you will have a sing along on your hands like no other. You know, and that's it's so great because you're able to just pull that song up and uh, play it on the chord buddy. And uh, just to remind everybody, Chord Buddy is a learning system. And so there's a, there's the Chord Buddy device that you attach onto the guitar, and it allows you to play chords with one finger uh, as you learn how to strum, how you learn that rhythm. And then uh, you slowly uh, start putting your fingers on the strings by removing those chord tabs. It's a, it's a wonderful learning system. And, uh, you know, if, if you, if you add the chord buddy system, whether you're looking at, maybe you've got a guitar already, or you're thinking, you know, I need the whole, all, the whole set. I want to get a new guitar. Uh, I want the chord buddy. I want the learning system. I want the song books. If you do it now, uh, in two months, you could be playing without the chord buddy when summer comes and you're ready for those backyard campouts. Uh, imagine a family reunion. And uh, everyone comes, and you pull out your guitar, and you start singing Country Roads by John Denver. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what fun that would be, huh? Tremendous That's, amount, I can tell you. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, uh, Travis, as we were just, you know, we've been talking about camping. And uh, one of the other things was recently that uh, you were involved with uh, kids that are putting on programs. And uh, the high schoolers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a program that uh, is uh, was started here in Alabama, but it's starting to spread across the nation. It's called Reach and Teach. And I'm on the board of directors, and I try to attend uh, several of them as I can. And I, and I always, the ones that I attend, I actually go up at the end of the concert and with a guitar and and give uh give a guitar away with a chord buddy on it a, a, a whole combo system but uh just so uh if you see a reach and teach program coming to you please support it in your schools what it is it's they go in and the kids actually put on a real life rock concert and they're responsible for everything from advertising to ticket sales to security to setting up staging lighting <clears throat> excuse me they they had to do everything just like if they were in the real world and they were the promoter putting on a rock concert mm -hmm. and uh and they're graded on it uh and then they're also able to go out in the community and meet with business leaders and ask for sponsorship or or donations um you know money they're also able to sell tickets and and they make this money. I mean, they get to keep the money. And uh, so it's, it's a wonderful program. It's called Reach and Teach. And Core mm -hmm. Buddy is proud to be a part of it. And uh, I, fact, I, I think I may have uh, sent you a couple of pictures. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll bring those up sometime and, uh, and share those. There was yeah, some one really good. walking on really stage with my, with my having guitar in one hand and my fist pumping in the other. And the other picture that I sent you was the, the winner of mm -hmm. the, uh, of the combo. It's really sweet. You know, that's, it's a, it's a great, it's a great deal. So, uh, just to let people know that, uh, when you buy cord buddy, uh, Travis has been, he's been around and, uh, if you've seen him on shark tank, uh, season three, episode three, 
uh, which you can get right here on Amazon. Uh, if you go to season three, episode three, you can watch his his uh, negotiations with the sharks, and they all wanted a part of Cord Buddy. And uh, one of the questions that came up was, why is not this <laughs> not made overseas? But uh, Travis, you were adamant that uh, you wanted to, this to be made in the U.S. Uh, for uh, um, creating jobs here. And I know I've been to the factory where the injection molding is done, and that's right around the corner from the plant where they're all assembled. Uh, and same thing with the where the books are printed. Uh, there's a lot of jobs that are created uh, by Cord Buddy. And so you're donating to schools, uh, also veterans. And uh, so there's a lot of good that's coming out of uh, that little plant in Dothan, Alabama. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> the, the, when Mr. Wonderful, you know, said, hey, you could, you could, you know, uh, get this made for half price in China or even less. And, and uh, then I remember Mark Cuban, he, he spoke up and he said, yeah, you could probably s squeeze a few more pennies out, you know, and, and, uh, but, but he's, he's creating jobs. He's, he's mm -hmm. providing a, a business that, that provides for their families. You know, I, and, and it's just, a, it's very important to me. I'm so sick of everything being sent to come in from China or Mexico or something. And, and it's just, you know, it's when there's American workers wanting and needing jobs and, and we send everything overseas. Oh, and I've jobs. always said, I can make mm -hmm. it cheaper, but at what cost? And what mm -hmm. I mean, not, mm -hmm. not what cost of money, <clears throat> but what cost to our nation. Yeah. And then uh, sure enough, all these uh, supply chain shortages and ships sitting uh, in the harbor, not able yeah. to unload. And uh, and uh, Chord Buddy is available. In fact, Chord Buddy guitars are available. And, um, you know, I just uh, I love how easy it is for people to uh, to play. And, um, you know, I know we got people that, that kind of cycle through. Can you, uh, can you give us that, uh, John Denver song again? I just want to show yeah. people yeah. how easy it is, um, to, to play songs with chord buddy. And, uh, so John Denver, uh, a lot of people know his music and, uh, so I'll just, uh, let's go ahead and almost heaven. West Virginia, Blue Ridge Mountain, Shenandoah River. Life is old there, older than the trees, younger than the mountain, blowing like the breeze. Country road, take me home, take me home to the place. I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home, country road. So the chords that you're playing there, what are the, what are the chords that you're using and, and how are you playing those on, on Chord Buddy? Well, the blue one. Uh, now this is a key of G chord buddy, meaning that it, uh, well, first the key of G is, is, is always, and I've been a teacher for 45 years, the first key that you learn. So that's why we wanted to make a key of G chord buddy first, cause it's where you start on guitar. Ukulele is different. You, you start in the key of C. So we mm -hmm. made, it, we have a key of C chord buddy for ukulele, but uh, the blue one, this one plays the, the G chord, the primary chord, and it's typically played with the pinky finger. The ring finger plays the D chord, that's the red one. The middle finger plays the green chord, that is the C chord. And the index finger plays the yellow button, which is the E minor. And so there's four buttons and you have four fingers, right? So each finger has its own button. And, and now 
which if you have hand issues and have to use one finger, okay. But as, as far as the learning tool goes, we want you to use these fingers on these buttons because that helps you learn finger dexterity, finger strength. Uh, and, and so because when you start playing for real, when you remove the chord buddy and start playing for real, you're going to be using more than one finger. So we want you to be getting all of the fingers in the game, so to speak. Because then uh, now you've removed the tab and you're playing the D on your own. The next week you remove the green one. The next week you remove the blue one. The next week the yellow one. And within 60 days, this whole thing is off your guitar. Now, I'm asked, uh, what if it takes me longer than 60 days? Or what if I want to do it before 60 days? Hey, we we all learn at different speeds. So if it takes you six months, it's not a race. It's not a race. Just make sure mm -hmm. that you go at your own pace. Have fun. That's the biggest thing. Have fun. I've had uh, people finish the whole system in, in, in two weeks you know, but they worked on it five or six hours a day. So it's not a race. Main thing, have fun and go at your own pace. Yeah, that's the, that's uh, what makes it such a great tool is, is that uh, you can start playing right away. But then, uh, and some people, because as you said, uh, there's a lot of people that maybe have arthritis or uh, other issues uh, nerve issues, uh, nerve damage. We have a lot of veterans that tell us uh, they're able to play guitar because of chord buddy. And without chord buddy, they wouldn't be able to play. A lot of senior citizens uh, folks yeah. are able to play where they may have played for years, uh, even played professionally. And then uh, as uh, arthritis and other conditions, it took that away from them and chord buddy gave them music again. I hear that story, Scott, literally all the time. Uh, had a lady here a while back, uh, called me up, said she wasn't satisfied with, she just got it now. She just got it. <clears throat> had had it one day. Said hey, these, these the chords aren't aren't sounding clear like, like they do with you. And, and I told her, I said, listen, I want you to trust me. You trusted me to buy this. I want you to trust me with this. <laughs> do it 30 minutes a day. Work on it every day. In about two weeks, you will notice your fingers getting stronger. And you may notice it before then. So anyway, cut to the chase. She sent me an email two weeks later said, you were exactly right. They, they are sounding clear, just like yours do. Uh, so, you know, when you're older or even not older, you're using muscles, you know, that you're not used to using. And, it, and you just don't have the hand strength sometimes, especially as senior citizens, they, they, they lose hand strength. So Chord Buddy is wonderful. One of the mm -hmm. best exercise tools, you know, outside of learning guitar, it's a great exercise tool. Yeah. For, you know, for and it, it, you know, there's a, a lot of research too, that talks about uh, how healthful, learning to play music is for your brain. Uh, just the, the, the uh, exercise that uh, happens within your brain when you're playing music. And that's yeah, another, yeah. It, that's a lot I better than playing crossword puzzles. <clears throat> I did some research on that, Scott, several years ago. Mm -hmm. And I was shocked uh, uh, at, at the amount of study that had gone into how music helps advance the brain had uh, that it connects things uh it's it's pretty it was an amazing study that mm -hmm. music is so important for develop the development of brain yeah and that's and that's one of the things that i think is just so interesting uh about chord buddy is because uh you can start playing music right away it doesn't it's not going to take you years to master uh, the guitar now to, to play a lot of other things, but you can start right away with, uh, like earlier as you were playing country roads, uh, four chords, really simple. Um, and you can start and then work your way to the point where you're not using chord buddy or, you know, there are people, uh, we see them all the time in the, in, uh, letters and communication that people have uh, with you that, 
uh, they just love playing with chord bedding because it's easy and they can just focus on on finding the songs that they want to play. Yeah, I, I have a lady, bless her heart, goes to our church and uh, she's had a chord buddy. Uh, well, I've, I've, she's on her on her third or fourth chord buddy. She wears them out. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I asked her, I said, when are you going to take that thing off your guitar? And she says, never. I said, mm -hmm. why? She says, I don't care to know how to play. I just want to accompany myself and sing. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I don't care that I'm that I'm learning guitar. And I said, well, it's a free country, so uh, so you do what you <laughs> want to do. Well, there's a uh, um, there's something for everybody, absolutely. And you know the the um, the songbook that comes with the chord buddy. And there's, uh, I think, 100 songs? 106, there? I think, yeah. 106 songs in the in the songbook. So when you buy, if you have a guitar already and you buy just the Chord Buddy Learning System, it comes with the Chord Buddy, it comes with the Learning System book, and uh, there's videos online that will help you uh, learn each lesson, learn the strumming patterns, and then uh, learn how to put your fingers on the strings as you start to remove the chord tabs. Uh, but then you've got the songbook. And so you can, you can start playing 106 songs right away. And uh, Travis, I think one of the things that uh, uh, I think you did this song with um, Robert Herjavec, uh on Shark Tank. And uh, this was the, the first song that he ever played, I think, on guitar was with Chord Buddy. And it was one of your mother's favorite songs. And, and I was wondering if uh, you might yeah. do that for us as well. Sure. Yeah, my mother's favorite song <clears throat> was Amazing Grace. And it's a, it's a, it's, it's a wonderful uh, Christian uh, worship song. Uh, Amazing Grace, how sweet the sound. That have saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now, thank God I'm found. I was blind, but now I see. Uh, that's just amazing. Isn't that just beautiful, Travis? I love uh, how you're able to um, uh, play. And I'll say it, something that sounds a little more complicated, uh, but just using the Chord Buddy system and uh, being able to play. And I remember watching Robert Herjavec and, and his face Ooh. light up. Uh, and, and thank goodness... I have seen that same look of amazement and wonderment uh, and excitement in thousands of people's faces uh, when they, for the first time in their life, they play something pleasing on the guitar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah you know, and I was just, uh, I, I just, uh, you know, we've got a few camping things here in the carousel. I just put the, um, uh, my family loves sitting in the backyard around the around the fire, uh, around the fire pit, mm -hmm. and um, you know I just remember it's it's a little cold now, but I remember last summer our whole family just sitting around uh, roasting marshmallows and uh, singing songs around that campfire. Hey Scott, we just did that Monday night at my house. Uh, we roasted marshmallows and and made s'mores. Uh, cause I went outside and, and I said, who's got the fire pit going And Goodson, my 11 year old, he says, I do daddy. We're going to roast marshmallows and make s'mores tonight. So, <laughs> oh, you know, that is, that is perfect. Isn't it? Just, it uh, these are some great family memories. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, you may, uh, they may watch a football game or, uh, something else, a movie, but the memories that you're going to remember is that uh, is that one right there. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> well, I just want to encourage everybody: uh, if you have a guitar uh, and you're and you wonder would a chord buddy work on it, 
uh, it's very likely that it will. Uh, there are a few different types of guitars out there. Some that have steel strings that have uh, nylon strings, and uh, uh, you can tell they they're they're nylon strings. It looks like fishing line might be uh, would be the way that you uh, would look at that. And there's a chord buddy that fits that. And so if you have any questions, uh, Travis, people can always reach out to you as well. Absolutely. Uh, my email is Travis at cordbuddy.com. If you uh, are not sure which Chord Buddy you need, hey, send me an email. Uh, it, it would be great if you would snap a picture of, of the headstock of your guitar. But send it to me and I'll say, hey, you, uh, this is the Chord Buddy that you need. I'll, yeah, I'll, absolutely. So Travis at cordbuddy.com. And I just want to say, uh, Tom, thanks for following. And uh, uh, I hope, Tom, y- you're either a guitar player or you want to be a guitar player uh, because uh, we've got it for you right here. So, yeah, if you've got a guitar that uh, maybe you bought years ago thinking, I'm going to learn to play guitar, and you're like, uh, uh, what, the 70% of people that stop playing in uh, just a short period of time, right, Travis? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, statistically, seven out of 10 will give up their dream of learning to play the guitar within 60 days of starting. So before they get over what we call the two-month hump in the teaching industry where hand-eye coordination, calluses form on the tips of your fingers, muscle memory kicks in, they get frustrated and give up their dream of playing. Because guitar looks easy. It's very difficult. I can tell you that much for sure and uh and another statistic that uh that we found out is that 75 percent of american homes have an unplayed musical instrument in it and mm. usually it's the guitar yeah 75 <laughs> now think about that 75 out of 100 homes has a guitar stuck in a closet or under the bed or, mm-hmm. or somewhere sitting unplayed, which means there was someone that gave up on a dream. Yep. Yep. And and so if you have a guitar uh, that you bought and you're one of those uh, folks that, that, that gave up because it's, because it's hard and, uh, and you didn't have a good, a good teacher, a good instructor, uh, maybe it's one that, uh, you inherited. Maybe it was, uh, from your parents, from a uh, brother, or sister, or someone, and, uh, it's in the closet, it's under the bed, take it out, tune it up, put a cord buddy on it and get ready for this summer. Uh, summer camping. I can't think of anything better than, uh, you've been having fun all day. Maybe you've been on the lake water skiing, or you've been hiking, and you come back and you get that campfire going, uh, just like Travis's son Goodson pulls out the uh, marshmallows and said, we're going to make s'mores. And then grab your guitar and uh, start playing some songs like uh, like Travis was doing. And and I know, Travis, uh, we've just about run the time that, you, that you've got here with us. Uh, but uh, would you be able to play that uh, John Denver song just one more time? Sure, sure. And then... Uh, <clears throat> And then I'll I'll let you uh, go and and get more chord buddies into uh, people's hands because I know you got to go uh, out and tune some guitars. I noticed when I came in to work this morning that our 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 uh, chef that has the naturals on it, we we were down to one. So I've got to go out and me and Brady tune up probably eight or eight or twelve and get it resupplied. So well, here we go. All right, almost heaven. West Virginia, Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah River. Life is over there, older than the trees. It's younger than the mountains, blowing like the breeze. Country roads take me home, far to the place I belong. West Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home, country roads. I said, take me home, country roads. Take me home, 
Old Country Roads. <laughs> well, Travis, thanks for taking us home with uh, that old that good John Denver song. Oh, yeah. uh, perfect for sitting around the campfire. And as, as uh, you were saying, if uh, you're out in your backyard this year or you're at the campground, you're at the beach, you're at the lake, up in the mountains, and you start singing that song, you're going to get a crowd and uh, create wonderful memories with your family. Mm-hmm. So, Thanks for having me, Scott. And we'll we'll, yeah. we'll see everyone back here next week at 9 o'clock. Set you, set, your, set you a reminder to be back here with us at 9 o'clock on Thursdays. That's right. And like you say, uh, Travis at cordbuddy.com. So anybody that's watching and you said, you know, I love that John Denver song. I liked it when he played uh, Amazing Grace. I would like to hear and set the song. And we'll see if we can bring that and work that in uh, mm-hmm. to this weekly show and uh, show you how you can play that song on Chord Buddy. So uh, Travis, thanks so much. I'm going to, I'll send you out. And uh, I'm going to keep going for a few more minutes here because okay. I want to show some folks uh, some other things about how we can, how, how Chord Buddy works. So, okay. All right. I'll, we'll, I'll see y'all next time. Take care. All right. Hey, that is Travis Perry. He's the uh, inventor, founder, and uh, owner of Chord Buddy in Dothan, Alabama. And uh, season three, episode three of Shark Tank was where he came to uh, the big prominence when he won a deal with Robert Herjavec. In fact, all of the sharks, all of the sharks were wanting to get a piece of Cord Buddy. Uh, but uh, Robert prevailed that day, and he did. He learned how to play guitar. And his face, if you watch that episode, uh, Robert was able to uh, play Amazing Grace on guitar it was the first song that he played on guitar so uh you can be like that as well and uh and so i've got the i've got a chord buddy here on the guitar this is the the perry guitar and uh you know we've got that highlighted in the carousel let me just get the um, natural guitar there so when you buy the chord buddy kit the complete guitar you get uh, these really nice uh, Perry guitars, just beautiful tops, back and sides, the neck. These are very playable guitars. It is uh, the height of the strings off of the neck here is just right. Every one of these, Travis Perry at Chord Buddy goes through personally and sets these up to make sure that uh, that everything is the way that it should be so that when you get at home, uh, you, it arrives at your home. You can put the chord buddy on there, and the chord buddy allows you to play these uh, chords with one finger. And then, as you uh, learn and get the rhythm down, then you're able to slowly remove these tabs, uh, individually remove these tabs, and then you're using your fingers on the strings. And in fact, I've got a little video uh, that Travis put together, and it shows you how. This is the the D chord, and this is the first one that you remove when you start learning how to play guitar. So let me go ahead and run that little video. Well, all right, guys, this is a point in the system of Chord Buddy where, as my daddy would say, the rubber hits the road. Uh, Up to this point, we've been focusing on right hand rhythm, timing, different strum patterns. We've learned four different strum patterns. We've been focused on learning some songs, getting some finger dexterity going. Now it is the time to start removing these tabs and start making the chords on your own. This is an exciting time and I'm glad that we're here. All right, so what we're going to do first is how do we remove the D tab? All right, the best way to do it, and I'm going to keep this at an angle for you to see it best. You may want to lay it down in your lap, but I'm going to keep it up. What you want to do, you want to press the, the blue one down so you get it out of the way, okay? Now, this is, I, this is the way to take it off with it on the guitar. Uh, from the factory, these things are in there pretty tight, so you have to pull it pretty hard, okay? So, But you're not going to break it, so don't worry about that. So push the blue one down to get it out of the way. 
lift up slightly on the red tab and give it a pull. And there you are. Now it's out. So let's go over how to make the D chord. So you want to refer back to your book and there is a uh, diagram there of how to make the D chord. There's a hump right here. Okay, this hump is here for a reason. That is so that you can get your index finger under the hump and it falls perfectly onto the G string. Okay, that gives you enough room to get to your others. See that right there? So, to make the D chord first, put your index finger on the hump and then just slide it off and it will fall directly on to the G string. Then place your middle finger on the second fret, first string, your index finger, I mean your ring finger on the third fret, second string, and then you, again you strum from four down. That is your D chord. And uh, that is uh, how you slowly uh, and methodically start removing the tabs. So you've learned the rhythm. You've learned the strumming with Chord Buddy. And now you've practiced and you've strengthened your hands and your fingers. And then you take those tabs out. And that's why Chord Buddy is a guitar learning system. And you learn the rhythm, then you strengthen your fingers, and then you start pulling those out. And, uh, you know, we are just talking about all of these things that you can do this summer. And um, one of the things that, uh, that I like to do uh, camping is, um, well, I like backpacking and uh, or just going out. Uh, and uh, having a stove is really helpful. And one of the best stoves that I found is jet boil jet boil is the one that i've been using uh for many many years and it's a combination propane butane so you have these uh, canisters that have the the propane butane mix in there and then the the jet boil stove itself is all contained so there's a uh, it's this uh neoprene cover that uh, keeps it warm or keeps the heat in and protects your hands so inside you've got your uh, jet boil stove itself and so this is the uh this is the as they call it the engine and uh this engine right here then attaches right onto the canister and so in fact you can get canisters that fit inside this is a little bigger one uh, but they have smaller canisters that actually will fit inside uh, the jet boil and so then when you attach it and it's got the igniter button so when you uh, start the fuel you can push the igniter and get it started and then the the flame over here now here's another cool thing is this little uh, cup has a uh, plastic cover and it comes off and so you can see these uh, fins, these, these uh, uh, fins here on the aluminum. Now, when your, your cup fits right on top of the engine, on the jet boil engine, and when that fire is going through, it's not only going up into the cup like, a, like traditional heat, uh, but it's also going into these, uh, through these fins. These fins heat up and then transfer that uh, heat right up into the water here. And so they call it jet boil because it boils fast. So uh, this is a one liter cup. Uh, there's bigger ones, there's uh, different sizes. Uh, this is the one that has been working for me for years. Now, not only do I take it camping with me, but also when we're just on road trips, I'd love to bring the jet boil with me. And uh, you can always heat hot water. I make coffee, tea. Uh, if you've got any uh, kind of little snacks, uh, that uh, cup of noodles type thing where you just need hot water and you're on the road. And uh, pull over to the rest area, put the water in, hit the jet boil. And within a couple of minutes, your water is going to be boiling and ready for that. So I, I, 
love the jet boil. And then uh, my family is camping when uh, now if it's our whole family, we we do take uh, the larger tent. So we've got um, similar to this uh, Coleman cabin tent. So I I like the Coleman brand. It is the one that I grew up with, and uh, a full size cabin tent is really good for the family. Uh, when it's just my son and I, and we're just off to the um, lake to do some fishing, then the, the little two-man uh, Coleman Sundome tent is perfect. Uh, there are two shock-corded fiberglass poles that go through. They, as you, you just lay the tent out, the uh, poles crisscross so they form an x and they uh, fit through the little uh, channel on the top of the tent you can pop it up uh, it's uh, easier with two people but it is not hard with one person to be able to set that up and that's the perfect two-person tent and uh, so this is the one that my son and i use when we're going off just the two of us for a few nights uh, but the family tent is perfect now I have to I, I have to throw this hot tub in here. This is a little portable hot tub. And uh, I actually bought this for my wife this Christmas. And I tell you, it has gotten so much use. My family loves this particular one. Now, this uh, one that I've got highlighted here is a, it's an oval. It doesn't take up a lot of space. And it's uh, it you can put two people in there pretty easy. It is perfect for one person. And when we, when I got this and opened up the box, it only took me about 10 minutes to get set up. And this particular hot tub has the, uh, the, the, uh, bubbles, right? It's got the jets. And so there's a motor in there to run that. And so when you inflate this portable tent or portable hot tub, you just connect it right up to the, to the motor for the jets. And so it took me about 10 minutes to set up and inflate. And once it was inflated, then we just filled it up. So we put the garden hose in there. Uh, we filled that up. There's uh, lines on there. There's filters that are included. And then we turned it on, got the heater going. It's got a built-in heater. It's got a thermostat so you can set it. Uh, the ideal temperature, and this is according to my wife, the ideal temperature for the hot tub is 104 degrees. So we set that to 104 and let it heat up overnight, got up the next day and uh, it was ready to go. And the filters are screwing filters. You can clean them out. You can replace those later when they, uh, if they get too dirty, uh, but just cleaning them out is works really well. And so this hot tub has gotten so much use. So we got it set it up uh, Christmas time. So we had it all of January, February. Uh, here we are in March, winding down March. It's spring break here in Oregon. And uh, so, in fact, my wife was talking about uh, uh, she's got some uh, things that she's working on this morning. And then a little bit later on, she is going to get into the hot tub and relax. And so for those of you that uh, are just looking at, you know, what, what can you do? Now, that is a portable hot tub, and you could actually take this with you on your uh, trips if you've got uh, an outlet. So if you go to a campground that has the electric outlet, you can pack up this hot tub and take that with you and then um, set it up. Takes about 10 minutes to set up and plug in the heater and then by the next day. So if you're going for three, four days or a week and you can bring this hot tub with you, set it up, and have a private hot tub at your own campground. It's a, it's a, it's pretty amazing. And then uh, I, we also uh, like the portable campfire pit, the camp pit, right? So uh, in some cases, you there, the the campfires are restricted to certain uh, areas. And you need to have something that protects it, protects the fire from uh, escaping. And these fire pits are perfect. And we, we love having the little fire pit we can take, set up, and uh, either you can burn wood or you can put charcoal in it. 
and uh, that which is perfect for roasting marshmallows. You get the heat, and but you don't have all the smoke from the wood fire. And uh, my family loves it because being able to roast marshmallows and uh, sing songs around together. And it, it, earlier we were talking with Travis Perry, uh, inventor, founder, owner at Cord Buddy, and he was talking about uh, just this last week where uh, his son Goodson said, "Hey." We're going out to the fire pit in the backyard and we're going to be roasting marshmallows and having uh, and uh, making s'mores. And uh, our fire pit in the backyard last year, I remember just sitting around there roasting marshmallows, making s'mores and singing songs together. Just some perfect family memories. And so I hope that uh, you've been inspired by uh, Travis showing how he can play Country Roads, uh, how he played Amazing Grace. And there are so many songs that you can play with Chord Buddy. And uh, be ready this summer as you go camping, uh, learn guitar, start now. If you're like so many people, uh, as Travis said, uh, one in seven households has an unplayed musical instrument in it. And it's probably a guitar. If you've got that guitar, get Chord Buddy, put on it. Learn how to play guitar. Be ready. When you've got that uh, family gathering, the family reunion, the backyard party, and uh, you're able to pull out a guitar and uh, play songs, the guitar, the Chord Buddy guitar learning system uh, has the lesson books, the guitar, uh, uh, the, the guitar learning system, and a songbook with, uh, I think Travis said, over 100 songs, 106 songs in there. You're going to find one that you're able to play. And there are plenty more songs that you can play with Chord Buddy. So uh, anyway, this has been a lot of fun. I love camping. I love getting out. I love going to the mountains, to the beach, to the lake, to the river, and spending time with my family. And playing guitar is a great hobby to have. And uh, so I hope Chord Buddy and camping go together for you as well. As we go out and uh, end this broadcast, uh, I'm going to play uh, another video with Travis showing how to play Hound Dog on, um, on the guitar using the Chord Buddy. And so we will be back here. Travis and I will be back here at 9 a.m. Central every Thursday. So we'll be back here next Thursday at 9 a.m. Central. And if there are songs that you would like to learn how to play on Chord Buddy, uh, send a message to Travis, Travis at ChordBuddy.com, and uh, we'll work those in. And for right now, I just want to wish everyone a fabulous day. Going to teach you an Elvis Presley all-time great mega hit. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. The song, not you. I, I, I'm, I didn't mean you. I meant the song. <laughs> uh, this is going to incorporate some techniques that is not on your Chord Buddy DVD. Um, it's called the pedal move. And the pedal move would be when you advance, if you're playing a, a boogie woogie like a... a well, when I go down with my pinky there, that's called pedaling, okay? So what we're going to do here on the G is you're going to hold the, the blue down, target the top three strings, six, five, and four, and you're going to pick it twice, strum it twice, and then you're going to keep the blue pressed and add the yellow to it. See? And that makes uh, a boogie-woogie pattern, shuffle pattern. When you go to the green, you're going to press it with your middle finger, target the fifth, fourth, and third string. And you're going to uh, pedal to the red. All right. When you go to the red, the D chord, you're going to target the bottom four. And that's, that's uh, your pattern for this, okay? Uh, again, I'm using... Um, uh, garage band drum loops. This is uh, it is the funky shuffle drum set pattern 21. And all you do is you set your tempo to what you want it to be, and you hit it, and it plays the drum beat for you. Very simple. It gets more complex if you want to build tracks and add piano and bass to it. If you want to learn that, please send me an email saying do more garage band. 
and I'll do my best to do it. Here we go. Hey, pretty funky, isn't it? You ain't nothing but a hound dog crying all the time. You ain't nothing but a hound dog crying all the time. You ain't never caught a rabbit and you ain't no friend of mine. Well, you said you was high class. That's just a lie.